it's just a quick little how-to video so right now with my i own a sign frs as some of you guys know I started yesterday when i would like i'd be driving and then when i'd slow down the rpms would go down to like 500 to a thousand and the engine would kind of be like like it go super it would start shaking and stuff so the rpm like would dip and then it would go back to normal and so i just i'm just gonna hear i'm just gonna tell you guys how to how to fix that shit so most of the time people will tell you like oh oh it's a major problem or some bullshit you know if it's not with uh with these types of engines at least with the early models like i have a 2013 um it's known it's notorious for having this problem so like in the throttle body there's sometimes gunk in there they get stuck in there and then it causes the flap to like not be able to open so then basically the engine gets not enough air and it's limited so it doesn't use its full power basically which causes the engine to you know like shake and i'll do all that shit so i'll just teach you guys how to do it all right guys here it is so this is where it is so you need to just unscrew this and pull this out and have it to the side all right so usually you would actually um you'd actually unscrew this you take this apart so you yank these two apart and you also take this apart also and you take this here off but i got a little too lazy so i just took this off so basically as you guys can see there is some there's some gunk right down there along the lining and there's some gunk in there but you actually need this flap open but there's no way to actually open it you can't press it or whatever so i'll show you guys how, to, how i do it all right guys how i opened that flap was i took the key i turned it like halfway so the engine's not on but like the interior like you know everything else works so like the window works and all this shit and then i put something super heavy so in order for that flap to be open you need something like you need the gas pedals to be pressed down so i just put a big old piece of metal at the um at the gas pedal so as you guys can see now it's actually open so now i can actually get in there and clean it all right so what you need to spray in there is mass airflow sensor cleaner so as you can see this diagram right there is actually this exact thing right here yeah it's the same so basically all you do is take this and you just spray, you just spray it all in there. Um, spray it at like the crevices and stuff to make sure that it uh, covers the whole thing. You just take like a cloth or anything. I recommend these ones. Like uh, these ones are super effective, but you just put it in there, wipe it around a little bit, and then you see all the gunk that comes out. After you guys clean it, you actually, as you can see, there's a lot of, this was all, this all was in there. So this basically just causes it to just not, this flat right here, not be able to open, decreasing airflow to your engine. So. Yeah, this is basically it. So I hope you guys found this helpful. I actually cleaned it last night also, but I didn't record it, so I just recorded to make sure it's shared with you guys. So hope you guys found this helpful. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.